The great Stoic philosopher Epictetus once said, The key is to keep company only with people who uplift you, whose presence calls forth your best. You've probably heard the saying, you're the average of the five people you spend the most time with. Today, we delve into this idea through a Stoic lens, exploring the seven types of people who can derail your progress in Stoic philosophy and how to navigate these challenging relationships. 1. The Complainer Draining your reservoir of emotional energy. We all have that friend, family member, or coworker who finds fault in everything, the perpetual complainer. Stoicism teaches us to focus on actionable solutions instead of dwelling on problems. Limit your exposure to chronic complainers, mentally distance yourself during their diatribes, and steer conversations toward solutions. Guard your mental peace diligently to stay on the stoic path of resilience and virtue. 2. The Drama Magnet – Navigating Stormy Waters Imagine navigating your life like a ship through calm waters until you encounter the drama magnet, a whirlpool of crises, conflicts, and controversies. Reflective listening and selective unavailability can help you maintain your course. Remember, true happiness lies in enjoying the present without anxious dependence upon the future. Sail your ship calmly. Steering clear of whirlpools that threaten your voyage towards personal growth and tranquility. 3. The Naysayer, Dulling Your Vibrant Canvas The naysayer, like strokes of gray paint, dulls your vibrant canvas with persistent doubt and negativity. Instead of absorbing their negativity, employ positive confrontation or ask for advice to encourage constructive conversations. Remember Epictetus' wisdom, we have two ears and one mouth so that we can listen twice as much as we speak. Discern valuable input from mere noise, ensuring your canvas remains a masterpiece of your own creation. 4. The Victim – Blaming External Forces for Every Move In the game of life, the victim blames external forces for every poor move, perpetually in checkmate. Compassionate detachment and setting firm boundaries are essential when dealing with a victim. Remember. In the chess game of life, being perpetually in checkmate is often a choice, not a fate. Take control of your game board, make strategic moves, and play for growth and wisdom. 5. The Toxic Positivist – Sprinkling Confetti on Your Garden The Toxic Positivist exudes excessive positivity, dismissing any negativity with a wave of glittery optimism. Embrace emotional granularity, acknowledging both positive and negative feelings. Seneca's reminder of true happiness includes understanding duties, even when they aren't pleasant. Balance life's complexities with equanimity, allowing your garden to flourish with both sunshine and rain. 6. The Manipulator – Rewriting Your Life Script The manipulator subtly rewrites your life script through emotional or psychological maneuvering. Employ fogging to agree with truths but refuse emotional coercion. Set clear boundaries, say no assertively, and remember Epictetus' wisdom, we cannot choose our external circumstances, but we can always choose how we respond to them. Reclaim your script and guide your journey with your values and decisions. 7. The Time Vampire – Disrupting Your Harmonious Symphony Picture your daily routine as a carefully crafted symphony, each instrument representing a task or commitment. The Time Vampire with trivial interruptions, can turn your symphony into discordant noise. Use the Pomodoro technique to protect your productive time and learn to say no assertively to social time vampires. Time is a precious resource, allocate it wisely to compose your life's harmonious masterpiece. A Symphony of Self-Awareness As we conclude our exploration into characters that can derail our stoic path, remember that self-awareness is key. Recognizing these types in others is enlightening, but understanding and improving ourselves is the true essence of Stoicism. If this discussion has sparked introspection or realization, share your thoughts and experiences in the comments. May your choices align with your virtues, your actions reflect your wisdom, and your life be the masterpiece you're meant to create.